What happens when a president is impeached? When a president is impeached, it means that they have been formally accused of committing high crimes and misdemeanors or other serious offenses. Impeachment is a political process and does not automatically remove the president from office. The specific steps and consequences of impeachment vary depending on the country and its legal system. I'll explain the general process in the context of the United States, as it is often referred to when discussing presidential impeachment. In the United States. 1. Impeachment in the House of Representatives. The process begins with the House of Representatives. The House has the power to initiate impeachment proceedings by drafting and approving articles of impeachment. These articles outline the specific charges against the President. The articles of impeachment require a simple majority vote in the House to pass. 2. Trial in the Senate. Once the articles of impeachment are approved by the House, the case moves to the Senate for trial. The Senate acts as the court for the trial proceedings. The Chief Justice of the Supreme Court presides over the trial. The Senate must reach a two-thirds majority vote to convict and remove the President from office. 3. Consequences of Conviction If the Senate convicts the President, the specific consequences can include removal from office and, in some cases, disqualification from holding any future public office. However, the Senate can also choose to impose a lesser punishment or no punishment at all. The Senate has the discretion to determine the appropriate penalty following a conviction. It's important to note that impeachment is a political process, not a criminal trial. The specific grounds for impeachment are determined by the country's constitution or laws, and they can vary. In the United States, impeachment is reserved for high crimes and misdemeanors, which is a broad term that encompasses serious abuses of power, corruption, or other significant misconduct. It's also worth noting that impeachment does not automatically mean guilt or removal from office. It is ultimately a decision made by the legislative body conducting the impeachment proceedings.